Hi everyone and welcome to this edition of the Trade of the Day, sponsored by Pristine Trading. Today's trade was QQQ, the NASDAQ 100 ETF, in other words, trading the market itself. Profits about $2,400 on a $1,000 risk amount in a single day. This is an all day long trade. Strategy based on a five minute PBS in a strong uptrend this week and entry on a one minute failed PSS. Date 716 Thursday reward to risk about 2.4 to 1. For those of you that are new and have not had any formal education in trading, I encourage you to attend Pristine's free aftermarket lessons Mondays and Thursdays and sometimes other days of the week. Be sure to check the schedule at pristine.com for the latest up to date information. Here's the trade. This is the QQQ. Now, this was featured a couple of weeks ago, the QQQ trade. This is a different trade but I'm using the same symbol because there was an important kind of point or lesson to this. Um, this is on the gap up right to here on this particular day. And this is at a time that a lot of people were saying the market was already way too extended to the upside at the time that it gapped. Uh, on a gap like this, it is possible to look for short opportunities on a smaller term basis. As a matter of fact, I shorted the market. You see the red that's in there. I did short the market at the open and I tried to get a little bit greedy with it. I thought it would come in a little bit lower first below 111. I ended up lowering the stop and taking a partial loss on it. But then the real trade of the day was to be long as soon as the market showed it wasn't going any lower. One of the keys was that we had this all day consolidation the prior day. That's one of the reasons you know that uh, the, the long is the favored way to go. And also a very long discussion we've had in our letters about how this bottom in the market back up, uh, at the beginning of last week when the market first made that first gap that we said that was going to be the permanent bottom for um, actually for several months to come very likely. And so far that's proven true as the market has blown right through that top that's been in place for many months. But this is on the way up to that top. And right in here, uh, this is a 15 minute chart. So you see the bigger picture. And I want to show you also that the market actually continued much higher the next day and actually even the next day. So we continued up well after this as well. But coming down inside of that there, there's actually a five minute buy setup but it's a very sloppy one. So I came down on the one minute chart and it's a little difficult to explain this in a short time, but it's what we call a breakdown failure on the one minute chart and the subsequent one minute cell setup failure that gives confirmation that that five minute chart PBS is going to actually take hold and work. And that's what was used entry uh, over 111.32 stop on a 111.15. Um, targets were split into three on this. Uh, the first surge is actually going to be um, an all day hold with half um, being sold on a strong rally. That was kind of a questionably strong rally. So I took out a third at 111.64 and then another third later in the day at 111.83 with the last hold in the close and actually closing at the high of the day there 111.92. This play was based on the pristine method. And like all the plays that I do, it can be found right in a manual. I believe it's important to keep things simple. And once you know the pristine method, this is a very straightforward play. For those of you who like to see this type of action every day or available during the day, I'm in the Pristine Method Black Room along with Sammy and Robert, and we're doing things like this all day long. Come visit us, take a trial if you've never had one before, or come sign up for a month, talk to your counselor if you are interested. And for those of you who are looking for a broker, there are tremendous benefits to Pristine clients who use Lightspeed. Ask your counselor to go into detail about all the benefits you can have. Until next time, this is Paul Lang. Feel free to contact me with any questions at paul at pristine.com. Thank you.